Hey guys, um, today I'm going to do a graphics tutorial for the Club Penguin Star Wars logo. Um, so yeah, it's going to look like this. Looks a lot like the official one. So let's make a new make a new document. Uh, let's just new make it about. 2,371 pixels times 1,576 make the background transparent if you want um, just zoom out to about 25% um, get your shape tool and get the rounded rectangle tool um, now you want to go just do that make the fill transparent now you want to go to width at the top and make it 1612 pixels times 940 then just move that to about here then go back here and make the stroke 30 and this is the gradient so the first colour is going to be FF7A01 the next step will be FECF04 and then at the end it's FF7A01 again then what you want to do you're going to go to blending options Going to go to bevel and emboss. Um, you're going to make it screen. Yeah, you're going to make it zero percent here. So make sure it's all like this. Then you want to go to wait. Just make this 118 and 11. About 11. Yeah. Um, then you want to go to stroke make sure it's black and make it 5 um, then you want to go to drop shadow you're going to have it as multiply black um, the opacity is going to be 36% then the distance will be 0 the spread will be 48 and the size will be 8 and that's it for this this sort of outer outline thing um, now I'm just going to copy in the logo, Club Penguin logo so duplicate layer, put it on here. So right. Now you're going to you can put the text, so it's going to be the font is Star Jedi, so download that. Um, it's gonna be four hundred and forty five um you can just type in star. Star Wars yeah. oh, Why is it coming up there? Right, okay Just put them on separate layers, so star there Then you're gonna put Wars and you're going to put them right up to each other, about there. Let's just see where. Yeah, um, 400. Yeah, okay. You can just do that. Um, 
then you want for the text you're going to go to blending options so just do it on star, star first and go to bevel and emboss make the size 5, soften 0 um, get all like that um, highlight mode it's going to be screen you're going to have it at 75% and the color is going to be FF FF 0 0 and for the shadow mode you're going to have it on multiply you're going to have the opacity at 61% and it's going to be and the color is going to be black then you want to do a stroke and the stroke size is going to be 7 and make sure the color is black um, then you want to add the gradient overlay of course which is there so and it's exactly the same colors as this outline so yeah um, now you just want to copy the layer style and put it on wars so that's that bit done just wanna move it a bit maybe yeah okay now for the takeover part the font is Berthold Berthold I, I don't know how to say that actually um, gonna make it 159 so I can take over highlight it make it white just move it you can have it about there okay then you want to go to blending options you want to go to stroke you're going to make it six and leave the color as black then you want to go to inner glow and for that you're going to have blend mode as normal the um, color will be 009EE7 the choke will be 55 and the size will be 3 and you're going to put on a gradient overlay and take over here Okay, this is the color. You're gonna have 51A4CC, and at the end, it's just gonna be white, so FFFFF. Um, then that's the takeover part done, so yeah. Um, now you want to zoom in, um, go back to this part, raster size layer style. Now you need to sort of rub out here, so yeah, so you just want to rub it out because you're gonna so do about make it sort of the shape of the end of the text so that it looks so that it kind of blends in so the end has like a curve on it so you're just gonna don't make the curve too big yeah just like that then go to take over rub that all out And like with the N, the R is going to have this curve, so you're going to want to do a 
bit like that. So. Yeah, just do that and for the T just do that. But that's not done. You're going to get your paintbrush, make it five and make the colour black, not white. Just gonna don't get your paintbrush actually get the line tool it might look better for this part get the line tool um, cage I'm going to make it a bit bigger so. bit more bigger so now that's going to look it's going to suit it Um, yeah okay now you want to get whoops now you want to get your paintbrush just zoom in again paintbrush and you want to carefully Do that very carefully. Then you want to do it up the top. So let's go. That. It's done. Yeah. Now you have made your Club Penguin Star Wars Takeover logo. That was not hard. So um, I'll probably do the next. The next tutorial will probably be the tutorial for the um, Club Penguin logo. Let me just move the Club Penguin logo along. Uh, ah, okay. Yeah. So the next tutorial will probably be for this, basically, and it will look quite cool. Um, yeah. See you next time. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Yeah, bye.